The Pentagon on Wednesday said it would continue to support large numbers of BlackBerry phones made by Research in Motion Limited even as it moves forward with plans that would allow the U.S. military to begin using Apple includes Epony and other devices. The U.S. Defense Department last week invited companies to submit bids for software that can monitor, manage and enforce security requirements for devices made by Apple and Google include, with an eye to awarding the contract in April. The Defense Information Systems Agency disquietly posted its request for proposal on thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. The federal website on October 22, the same day that the U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement Agency said it would end its contract with RIM in favor of Apple's Ipony. Losing some of its Pentagon business to other providers could deal another blow to RIM which once commanded the lead in the smartphone market but has rapidly lost ground to Apple and Samsung's line of products as customers abandon its aging BlackBerry devices. For many years, the Pentagon relied solely on BlackBerry phones because RIM met its tough security requirements, but other companies have thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. In improving security on their devices, and a growing number of military commanders are clamoring for rival devices with bigger touch screens and faster browsers. The Pentagon spokesman said the U.S. military was working toward allowing vendors to supply other smartphones, while maintaining strict security requirements. He said the department aimed to use commercial mobile technology as it stepped up the use of new and innovative applications to support the military's evolving requirements. But the Pentagon also stressed it was not moving away from its use of BlackBerry phones. Thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. This is managing an enterprise email capability that continues to support large numbers of RIM devices while moving forward with the department's planned mobile management capability that will support a variety of mobility devices, the spokesman said. The DISA request for proposal said the software would manage at least 162,500 devices to start, but that number could grow to 262,500 by the end of the contract, which will have a one-year base and for six-month options. Ultimately, the Pentagon wants the software to support a total of a million devices, according to the Thank You for Trying Verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. Document. RIM spokesman Paul Luthier said his company's BlackBerry Mobile Fusion product could also be used to manage Android and Apple devices, and RIM was excited for the opportunity to include BlackBerry Mobile Fusion in the DoD's portfolio. Luthier said the product could enable the Pentagon to support a growing number of mobile devices across multiple platforms. Waterloo, Ontario-based RIM is also planning to introduce new smartphones that will run on the BlackBerry 10 operating system offering a faster and smoother user interface and a better platform for various smartphone applications.